Hello there everyone, this is Finis Ronan. Due to the reason that I got a few questions regarding my last video upload to Google+, Plus, where I used a background transparent overlay or face rig in one of my gaming recordings, I decided to make this short video to show you how I tackled the problem. So let's switch to my desktop and see how it's done. I don't say that my solution is a very performant or elegant solution, but at least I'm using free software, so we don't have to spend extra bucks on additional software. The software that I use is called Open Broadcaster Software. You can grab a free copy on the webpage obsproject.com. Uh, like I said, free and open source, so good combination. Also, it's a quite powerful software that's easy to set up it is also good so let's fire up the software this is how it basically looks um, in the main window you have an area called sources where you can add sources that you want to record um, i start by adding the game window that i want to capture just give it a name and select the window in my case borderlands which is already running in the background uh, select a stretch image to screen so it covers the whole screen area after that you just have to add the um, video capturing device of face rig for that to work uh, you actually have to enable the broadcasting option in face rig so just go to add capturing device give it a name FaceRig, for example, select the FaceRig virtual webcam and hit OK. OK, next to get transparency. Uh, yeah, for that you basically need to select a chroma key, which means that you need a one colored background. So in FaceRig, go to um, your background settings of the avatar, select a background with one color. Um, rearrange your character Whoop. and that's basically it for the face rig part and yeah okay yeah, it's a beta so yeah for some reason he does not track me anymore anyways <laughs> okay let's see a preview of the scene mode that we have set up so far so yeah as you can see you don't see the game that's just because the main game is running in the background and so the window does not get rendered and so there's no recording as soon as i put it up in the front you can basically see the whole scene rendered so uh, to arrange this you just hit uh, edit scene and then you can move the windows around um, due to the reason that you have the face logo on the lower corner um, you can either cut the window scene or in my case which is easier to just push it down a few pixels so that it's basically gone okay so far so good next we need trim background transparency for that just right click on the video capturing device select properties then select use chroma key select the chroma key black and hit ok okay that's basically it you have your overlay with transparency and now you could start broadcasting or start recording a video whatever you like uh, yeah that's it uh, i hope you enjoyed this small introductory uh, see you all next time bye bye